One of the things that I like to do for preparedness month is actually go through with my family and review preparedness plans that we've come up with in previous years. One of the things we like to do is go over our evacuation routes from our apartment and also meeting places that we can meet up, public spaces. Uh, if we are separated, uh, we can get back together in those locations. And you always want to have a couple of backup locations if for some reason the disaster that's affecting your home or apartment is also affecting one of those meetup areas. So it would make it unsafe. Uh, one of the things I also like to do uh, is to verify the contents of our go bags. Now you should always have a go bag for yourself and your family members in which you keep important materials that you need to bring with you in the event that you had to leave your home or apartment in a very short period of time, say in a house fire or some other incident that made you have to leave your home. Uh, one of the things that I like to do also personally is actually have a list of the contents that should be in my go bag. So when I'm going through and reviewing it, I can make sure that I've got all the things I need. And there's a lot of stuff that you might not be able to keep in your go bag all the time. You want to have identification with you, but you may not be able to keep it in your go bag. But if you need to check things at the last minute when you're running out of the house, you can take a look at your list, make sure you have everything, and then grab your boat go bag, get your family, follow your evacuation route, and go.